I'm Boomer Science for SI.com. Exactly one year since biogenesis scandal erupted and Major League Baseball suspended 13 players, DEA agents yesterday rounded up Tony Bosch and a half a dozen of his key associates. And they were charged with illegally distributing a controlled substance, anabolic steroid testosterone, not only to professional ball players, but also to high school and collegiate athletes alike. And this is where, I mean, a line has obviously been crossed. I often say I can understand why impoverished players from very poor communities in the Dominican Republic and South America and other areas might want to use something to get ahead because they see the big contracts that baseball is handing out. But to do this in Miami and to give it to college athletes, to give it to high school athletes, this is where you find the dregs of society. As far as I'm concerned, Tony Bosch and his partners can't go away long enough. They've already soiled baseball along with the baseball players who have been involved in this, but now this sheds a whole new light on just how they have preyed on the victims who are looking to score big bucks for Major League Baseball and I'm sure other sports. They need to go away for a long, long time, and hopefully this will act as a deterrent in the eyes of many other players and younger players and their parents moving forward. I'm Boomer Esiason for SI.com.